to fold unless we address these issues in a positive way. Now, can we solve all the problems? I don't think we can solve all of them, but I do think we can do more than what we are doing now in terms of addressing these impediments and uh, helping people to get in and save these and affordable housing. Uh, it talks about in the report how rentals are reluctant to report absentee landlords and stuff like that for real, of a uh, fear of, uh, you know, retribution from the landlord being kicked out of their apartments or their homes or whatever. But I won't go too much, we'll summarize that in the end. Uh, I wanted to allow Ms. Brown to uh, come up, and if she would, I wanted her to talk with you a little bit about community participation. And after that, we're gonna break and uh, eat uh, lunch, and then we'll come back and uh, have about 10, 20 minutes in summer, and then we'll open it up, and we'll have questions and comments. And once again, I encourage you with your questions and comments, if we can do something to try to move our city forward, and our communities forward. I will hope that that's what this meeting will be about because we know, I think all of us know, we go to any barbershop in town and you can listen to all the problems that we have. You go to the salon, in the street corner, you can find out what's going on in the city if you just listen. But there's very few places that I know where we come together and we talk about a solution. Uh, Dr. Robson is the main solution finders and I hope that we'll, that's what we can become, solution finders in this process. So with that, I'm gonna ask you if she would come up and speak and tell what y'all about it. Participation.